Okay guys, so today we're going to be making some brown stew chicken wings with some acorn squash. So here I have the um, chicken wings that I seasoned already yesterday. Um, so what I did to season it, or what I used to season it was um, some green seasoning, some garlic, some onion, some garlic powder, a little bit of um, clove powder, some small paprika powder, um, a little bit of allspice powder. I also put a little bit um, of some tamari soy sauce, which is a gluten-free soy sauce. And of course, uh, one teaspoon of salt. And I also added um, some Mrs. Dash garlic and herb seasoning blend. So that's what I use to season it. Um, and oh, yes, I also put a little bit of cinnamon powder as well. So this is the chicken season for the Bronx stew. And what I'm going to do now is cut up the acorn squash and some seasoned peppers. So I have about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, about seven seasoned peppers that I'm going to cut up now um, to, for the Bronx stew. I'm going to wear this glove when I'm cutting up the seasoning peppers because well, I'll put it on one time because um, I think some of these seasoning peppers are a bit hot so I don't want my hands to burn because I had used some yesterday and my hand was burning so which indicates that um, some of it was actually hot. That can happen like your seasoning pepper can be hot if you planted it near a hot pepper tree and because of cross pollination your seasoning pepper can actually become uh, hot if it was planted near to a hot pepper tree all right so i'm just going to cut this up you know a bit chunky because in any case it's going to melt as it cooks Actually, <laughs> I put that on the wrong hand. All right, so maybe rinse on my hand and put a glove on this hand. All right, so now that everything is cut up, let's head over to the store. Okay, so we're gonna leave to brown the chicken. Uh, we're not gonna add any liquid to this. We're gonna cook this for about uh, 10 to 15 minutes without adding any liquid. We would cover and check to make sure that the, that the whatever water the chicken um, would spring for itself that it doesn't dry down or start to burn. But we do not want to add water at this point in time or any chicken broth. So guys, I usually turn my fire down to low and I just cook 
the chicken for about 10 minutes without adding any liquid. So um, I just first I, I'm going to do it in five minute increments. So um, what I'm doing, I'm just stirring the pot and then I'm going to cover it again and I'm going to cook it without adding any liquid for about maybe about 10 to 15 minutes, between 10 to 15 minutes. Now guys, during this process of it cooking without you adding any extra liquid, you have to check it often and stir often to ensure that it's not um, burning, okay? Sometimes you might have to add a little bit of liquid if you find that it's starting to, to burn. Um, so keep monitoring it during that time period. All right, so I'm gonna start adding some liquid to this. The same bowl that I had seasoned the chicken in, I'm gonna add some chicken broth to that. Just add it to it. And I'm also gonna add in my acorn squash and seasoning peppers at this point in time. my flame up to medium so it will come up to a boil and then I'm going to cover and lower the heat so that it can cook. I'm now going to lower my heat. Bay leaf. 